So Dean, a uh, late 2-1 defeat today to Bristol City, what are your thoughts on the game? Obviously disappointed um, to be 1-0 up after 86 minutes and you know, we were under pressure a little bit at that point but I thought the boys were brilliant in the first half. I think Bristol probably came here feeling really confident, uh, they're, a, they're a really good team, playing a really good standard. Having a good successful season they probably came here feeling really confident and they probably underestimated us in the first half and I thought for the first 45 minutes we were the better team, playing some fantastic stuff got into the final third, into areas that we wanted to get into and then managed to grab the goal towards the towards the latter part of the half and then, you know, Kai McKenzie Lyles made an amazing save for the penalty to keep us one at the half time. So I came into the changing room, spoke to the boys, everyone's feeling good and just talked to them a little bit about their defensive work and second half it was a little bit bitty, Bristol were more aggressive, you know, came after us a little bit more and 65, 70 minutes the tide turned and, you know, it was all them and some of our players needed to do a little bit more work out of possession. And you know, we started to get overloaded in wide areas and with that sort of pressure building and building, it was only a matter of time and you know, eight, six minutes to go one one and then for them to grab the, the, the winner in the 90th minute was uh, you know was was really disappointing for the boys and you know, I, I can't ask any more of them. You know, we have players going down the cramp, we've got players coming back from injury and they gave it their all tonight, but unfortunately we just weren't good enough. You mentioned the quick start in the first half. Is this something you're trying to really instill in these young lads to really go for it from the off? Yeah, and last weekend with the 18s we scored after six minutes. The previous week we scored after eight minutes. And it's really something that we've been saying to the boys. You know, put your footprint on the game and go after teams and let them know what you're here for and let them know what you're about. Really get after them and, and show them how good you are. Because the teams that come here, they think you know, we're, we're a smaller club, we're League 2, we're Cat 3. And a lot of clubs haven't seen us play before. And hopefully tonight with the people here, they'd see the style of football that we want to play. And the fact that actually we've got a, gr a great group of young players who have got good futures in the game if they keep working hard. And I just, you know, I look back at the game and we were brilliant for a large part of it. But unfortunately, it's a 94, 95 minute game and you've got to make sure that you stay on it until that time. Because if you're playing against quality teams at the championship club, then you're going to get punished and unfortunately uh, they did that to us at the end. It's tough to pick out individuals, but Kai mckenzie Lyle between the sticks has put in a real shift. Uh, your thoughts on his performance? Yeah, he was excellent today. Um, we, you know, we were under the pressure a little bit. We'd scored after 38 minutes and they get a penalty three or four minutes later and we dominated the half and it would have been unfortunate to come in at half-time 1-1. And he's made a brilliant save and that was the start of what was a very, you know, very impressive performance from him. Made some brilliant saves, kept us in the game at points and it was, uh, you know, amongst others, you know, the group were fantastic, but 